honorable sisters, brothers, and friends. For usual, we begin the midweek happy hour by emphasizing the previous God's Day, Saturday and Sunday celebration of the Mass. That featured Divine Miracle 21. Christ heals a rich woman's daughter. I emphasize that Christ is declaring, letting us know that this rich woman, because she was charitable and humble, could also obtain eternal paradise. Thus, again, still, teaching us that in the eyes of God, belief and goodness obtain eternal paradise. I am a follower of the proper definition of words. Thus, when I declare that the USA from at least 1953 went hook, line, and sinker figuratively and literally down the road of criminally insane Hooverism. That critical statement has to be explained. Criminally means according to criminal law, the body of law dealing with crime. Crime, illegal activity and or actions, such as violating the laws of God, humanity, the Constitution, the Bill of Rights, civil law, etc. In this preacher's opinion, more than enough proof has finally exposed that J. Edgar Homer Hoover was a criminally insane, evil fellow. Couple that with the 18th century philosophy that English royalty shall rule colonialism, and with the royalty connection of George Bush administrators, you have a King George, Queen Hoover, not democracy, hypocrisy. Why and how can I bring that true fact to light during a religious discussion? Because the criminally insane Hoovers have decided and continue in their nuttier than a fruitcake and fruitier than a nutcake, that policy that they are going to have world domination, the laws of God, humanity, the Constitution, the Bill of Rights, civil law, international law, etc., are secondary to their colonial control of the world, especially by printing paper money, foreign bases, and info-gathering gadgetry. This preacher, from a position of authority, in the discipline of theology, proclaimed concerning burning in the fires of hell, what Christ said, Christ proclaimed that those like Hooverus will burn in the fires of hell. Uh, not my words, the proclaiming words of Christ to the likes of the criminally insane J. Edgar Homo Hooverus.